Hey guys, it's Minnie Mac and J Mac back for another raid video. What are we doing? Backstory. Backstory, okay. What are we doing a backstory index. on? Oh, index. Glad. You want to buy that? No, you don't. You don't have a job. All right, where are we going? Dark elves. Dark elves. All right. Mm -hmm. Who are we talking about? Yeah. Dark kale. Dark kale. Yeah. Uh, so I don't have dark kale yet. I'm still working on Doom Tower. That's where you get him, Doom Tower. Nice. So, what's the backstory here? Why are there two? Huh? I guess there was a normal kill, and then he went bad. Okay, that's kind of it in a nutshell. Okay. But here's the backstory. So, Enchantress... From Marvel? No. Oh, or DC? Yeah. <laughs> the superhero Enchantress? Enchantress? <laughs> Never mind, I was thinking something else. Exit out there, please. Okay. <laughs> Isn't there someone who has a name like that, though? Um, possibly, but... Wait, it... you were showing me the person the other day on your account. Are you talking about Wither the Crown? Oh. Yeah. Um, where is she? I don't... Maybe the Demon Spawn. Wither. Okay. Wither. Wither. Yes. This is who you're talking about? Yeah, for some reason I was... Okay, so the raid version of Enchantress. Yeah, for some weird reason I decided Enchantress. Okay. Alright, so... So she has a key role here. Because... Horcrux from Harry Potter. Okay. <laughs> Anywho. So, she, she... She looks like she could be a witch in her past life. Because she looks like a ghost. Yeah. So, I feel like she had something to do with why there are two Kales. Kales. How do you Kales. You can just say Kales for the sake of the video. <laughs> kind of got to get moving. We've wasted a lot of time here. Oh, sorry. So, anywho, she put a spell before she died. Um, She put a spell on Kale. Okay. And that made him evil. Well, th th there was still the original Kale. <laughs> Scare me. Alright. So, Kale. With she her, made, the spell. Like, the copy of him. She made a copy and put the spell on that one. And took that kill hostage. And knew, nobody knew that that was, like, the quote-unquote copy. Okay, so Dark Kill is just a clone. Yeah. Alright. And I, so... I mean, look at his eyes. Those look like robot yeah. eyes. Robot eyes. Well, <laughs> clone's not necessarily a robot, but okay. So, she cloned him uh -huh. with some gnarly dreadlocks. I He's mean... got the green jewel things, and then she has the Horcrux hidden. Harry Potter Horcrux right here that she's holding, and it's kind of hard to zoom in on and see, but it's got kind of a greenish tint to and it. it looks like it has like a skull in it. And a skull is flying around his staff. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell. So, as long as she has that, she has control of Dark Kale. Uh-huh. Her lungs will clearly be in up. Yep, yeah, look like she's got a few scratches there. A few? Yep. <laughs> Possibly some writing in blood. Who knows? So, she must have went through a heck of a ritual to uh, clone Kale and get Dark Kale. No, it's really simple. She took some of his hair and um, cloned him. Oh. With a simple spell. With a simple spell, okay. <laughs> so, we got Dark Kale from Normal Kale because Wither or Wither, I hate how so many names you can't pronounce right. Like Kale. Yeah. <laughs> And then we got Dark Kale. 
because Kent, the original Kel was sleeping and she cut off some of his hair whenever he wasn't paying attention and okay. took it and made the clone. Who grew a lot of hair. That's why he has so much hair because he was cloned from the hair. Sure. Okay, awesome. Good to know. Sure. He does look pretty cool. Uh -huh. But I mean, he has the skull going around. Yeah. Then look at what is on his back. Those Dreadlocks? Little... No, the, the, the knives. Okay, the knives? Those look slightly like the ones that killed her. Yeah, I don't know about I, that. I said slightly. They have like that same thing going down. Oh, the right. same curvature? Yeah. Yeah, well, I'd say it's a little different. Cause so, I'd different. say that the Dark Kale thought that she was an enemy and not a foe and killed her. Oh, so she cloned and then Dark Kale came to life and then ended up Cut killing her. her. Uh-huh. And now she has to live forever with a sword going through her chest. Mm hmm Alright. That is one heck of a story. In a very short amount of time. In a very short amount of time. Probably your shortest backstory yet. But there's more. Oh. <laughs> Spoke too there's soon. A, there's always more. All right. So what else we got? Mix it up. Okay. Okay. So. X. Oh, X. Back oh. to Dark X. Okay. Okay. So. Everybody thought that the real Kale j j just went evil. Okay. But they never knew what really happened. Yeah. So they just all assumed that he went evil and they all sort of hit him until one day he escaped. Yeah. And the first person to see him regular was none other than Apothecary. Apothecary, okay. Yes, because they're good friends. Right? Oh, Apothecary and Kale are good friends? Uh-huh. Okay, so we got Apothecary up here. Okay. So did the... So Apothecary saw the Dark Kale first? So he saw Dark Kale not too long before the regular Kale came running from a different direction. Oh, so the normal Kale escaped? Uh-huh. I just said that. Oh, well, I wasn't falling. Where'd he escape from? You know what? You can decide this time. It's not my story. No, I'm you, learning here. You get to decide where he escaped from, because you actually have some pretty good things sometimes. Like the van by the river. Oh, yeah. So, Wither the Crown stuck original Kale down in the van by the river and then clone dark kale was just running around having fun in the world and then original kale broke out of the van and apothecary saw him it was like hi hi <laughs> is that what happened no well then tell me what <laughs> happened so kale actually escaped from a wooded a cottage in the woods well, now that we're getting into, like, Hansel and Gretel, you're mixing too many <laughs> other stuff here. That ain't gonna work. It was a cottage in the woods down by the river. Okay. If that makes any more sense, okay? Not oh, Hansel and Gretel. Okay, so what did the Apothecary do so, once he saw... Apothecary, mind you, the Dark Hill had just been roaming in the village. Okay. And so Apothecary had gone out to the um river and when he was heading back he saw the dark kale go by so a few minutes later he sees the regular kale just come out of nowhere now did apothecary have his laser eyes before he met dark kale or did dark kale stare at him and now he's under dark kale's control okay. Ooh, i threw a wrench in your plan Wait, what? Huh? No! No, that was never planned! That was never planned! 
That was a plant. Dad, no. So you now do. Apothecary is going to turn into Dark Apothecary. I bet we get Dark Apothecary pretty soon. I don't know if we get Dark Apothecary. And then they all went and played volleyball. No. Apothecary didn't stare into his eyes. He, he always had those. Okay. But once Apothecary saw, they all took down the Dark Hail and sent him to Doom Tower. All right, then that's where we have to come in and free Dark Hell from Doom Tower. Okay. Good job. Backstory on the fly. Anything? Quit. We're trying to run professional video here. <laughs> Quit eating on live recorded TV. Okay. We good? Anything else you want to say before we quit? Here's a hint to the next video. Mine. Mine. Okay. Can't wait to see what the next one is. So, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you like anything at all you saw here. You can even subscribe if you didn't like it. That way, when you know new videos come out, you know not to watch them. Yeah. See that? Reverse psychology. Yeah. All right. Hope you guys all have a blessed night. Or day. We will see you next time.